Hello everyone, this is uh, Sandrock1, and today we are going to be doing a first impression on the uh, game uh, Rusty Hearts. I heard about this game from a friend of mine, Grey Matters 8. Uh, what the hell is going on? Um. Alright, here we are again. <laughs> uh, for some reason, the game was uh, doing something weird. So, ooh, hold on. No. Double click. No, no preview screen. So, uh, whoa, what are we talking about? Um, uh, 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 uh <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, all right, don't like him. He looks weird. Tudo Makita. Uh, sh sure, why not? Tudo Makita Caldo. You know what? Screw this. Mm. I'm gonna choose between one of the two chicks. I know this sounds weird, but I don't know. I, li I like the way this person moves right here. Or not moves, but um... <coughs> ah. Choose an it. Well, you know what? Never mind. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, I guess this is still just the beta? I mean, I have no idea where it is at right now. I, I went on the stream, I saw I could download it, and play it for free, so... Um, that's exactly what I'm doing. I don't like the way this guy looks. I just can't help it. Alright, I'm just gonna choose this guy for the whole of it. And he shall be named Zandrock. There we go. Do you want to play the tutorial? I can prove provide you with useful items. Sweet. So as far as I can tell, this game seems to be uh I, I have no idea if this is an MMORPG. I <laughs> I honestly have no idea anymore. I mean I guess it is an MRPG. I'm sorry, guys. I probably should have done my homework on this game, but I didn't because I am very stupid. Watch out! Hurry, try to keep up. This is gonna be fun, though. Where are we even going? <sighs> Seems cool so far. Are you sure he's not after us anymore? Oh, following us here. He's too big for this corridor. It sounds clear. You guys can stop running away now. Us, you were the one who panicked. Boobies. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't think Damn I've it. ever seen you move so fast. <sighs> amazing. Yeah, well, it's amazing what you can do in this giant monster chasing. Speaking of which, heads up, Franz. He spotted us again. I think he wants to say. Say hi. Uh, what do we do now? Go back the way we came. We'll be trapped in the hallway if we turn back now. Let's. First, get out of this hallway. There should be a way to ditch him. Oh, alright. So, I guess I have really no use for the mouse then. I mean. Alright, so, first impressions, real quick. Um, seems like a cool game. I mean, the music is kind of actually giving me, uh, hyped up a little. Ooh, this combat is. Oh, sweet. Alright, basic controls. I got that. Space star jump, defend. All right, cool. Oh shit! All right, sorry, I didn't read that. I mean, honestly, it does seem pretty cool. Uh, change skill point slot. K for skill mounting. Alright, perfect guard, hold Z. Step. Alright, so this passes. So we got the uh, uppercut, which costs 8 mana, which we have a lot of. Um, use a mighty uppercut to throw your enemies into the air. This is really cool. Throw a fury of punches. Cooldown is 4 seconds, but it costs 11 mana. 
All right. Man, I'm actually getting into this game right now. I can't wait. Let's do this! Worst. All right, so equipping shit. I mean, if I could use a controller for this game, it'd be a lot better, but, uh, I don't know. People might have different opinions. Oh, shit! Again, guys, uh, check out Grey Matters 8, description below. He might have more insight on this game than I do. He'll actually know a lot more than I do. My god. The, this, the, the people that made Perfect World made this game, which is actually real big changes in the uh, gameplay. Looks like he's found a way in. Auto I please. The final showdown already? This guy's got no sense of through this door. Oh, I get Quickly it. Now. He comes inside so we go back outside. Although we're kind of out in the open here. Man, this cow sure has, has a lot of hallways. I hope that white thing can't fit through that door. It's not advisable to stay out in the open like this. We need to find another way back into the castle. So I'm going to keep playing until I have the end of the tutorial. I have no idea how long that will take though. Hopefully not that long. Come on! Come on! Yeah! Alright, what can I say about the combat? It's good. I mean, real-time combat. Can't, nothing better. He's coming. Prepare yourselves. Is that... So this guy's a vampire I'm getting in? I don't know his eyes. Uh Franz! Snap out of it! Buddy. Here he comes! Wake up! What's the matter with you all of a sudden? Franz! Franz! Uh what can I say? I don't know. I, I didn't It didn't seem like she was shouting. She was like She was she was just going Franz! Franz or whatever how they pronounce his name. You would be like Franz! Franz! If you're gonna stand someone out of you, you're just going Franz! 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 Man, I'm talking to you! Are you listening to me? I can still taste your blood warm metallic. Alright, oh, this is a uh, real live action uh, RPG. Or MMORPG, my bad. I feel it in my veins, covering my heart in rust. Oh, press X. I'm pressing X. Whoa. Alright, talk. Chat. What do you want? If you got nothing to say, get out of here. Wait a minute. Weren't we just doing something though? I mean like... Oh wait, so that's how we can change. Alright, um... Chat. What do you want? If you got nothing to say, get out of here. Alright, hold on. Uh, alright. We got quests. I'll do this one quest real quick. My mind was somewhere else. <laughs> Just because you're a member of the Golden Sealed team, you think you can slack off? Not at all. Please, continue. As I was saying, we have contained Count Vlad within the castle and sealed it within the magical bar barrier. barrier. D-Day for the operation is six days from now. The reconnaissance team will support the Iron Lock Knights, the main force of the Golden Seal team, by gathering intel. This is a triple S class mission. The recon team's understanding of the situ current situation within the castle will be the key to the victory. I don't mean to interrupt, but we can't just speak to Major Nida. I'm sure she can fill us in all the mundane details. Is that why you thought it would be okay to daydream? 
if you've been paying attention, you know that the Major is too busy to deal with, her, with you herself right now. In the meantime, there's actually work for you here. You're not too proud to do it. This is a waste of time. Our time. Let's let Nada know we have arrived. I've already submitted a report to Major Nada. Would you like to hear her response? They just now got there. What a bunch of slackers. I'm too busy with the investigation to deal with that moody man. Just keep them busy with something like scouting the sewers for now. Unfortunately, that sounds like Major Nada. Then I guess it's time for you to go to work. Get to work. And I suppose I'm sure the sewer comment was just a joke, though. Right? Naturally. However, the recon team found a network of canals that connected to the castle. I want you to provide them with the all support they need to complete their investigation. Super darn canals. That sounds like a lot of sewers to me. I guess we got no choice. Let's go. Wait a minute. I haven't finished explaining the launch. Yeah, the operation. No, I think I've heard it quite enough. Oh, okay then, Mr. Vincent. Before you head out to the scout area, he should be the Lieutenant Ray at the Northern Cape entrance by now. Vincent's not part of this operation, so maybe... Oh. Oops. Uh, Alright, uh, what can I say? Oh, oh, welcome to this town. I guess I should have expected this would happen as soon as I got mixed up with Nada. Stop playing. Let's just find a way to the test. Yeah. The entrance is probably that way. I see sentries. Alright, uh, what can I say about this game? Uh, well, it is an MMORPG. Uh, only downside to it? As far as I can tell, there is no customization. I mean, I really want to find that package. Now that you're here. There is no customization, which I guess kind of sucks. Um, only thing that sucks, I gotta say, it's kind of cool how, I guess when you're doing quests, they do this whole gold methane thing. I want to know what this my room thing is. And apparently, searching for the right lucky effect for today, Paragon of Power. Um, today just might be your lucky day. Look for something exciting to do. Beware of strangers bearing gifts. Be ready for good tidings of fortune. They will originate in the West. Alright, so, um, you have your own room. I guess it's customizationable. Um, ooh, got a little lag. Uh, all right. So we got a uh, storage. So we got a certain amount of stuff we can store. So I guess kind of like a bank in a way. There is the out. Hmm. So oh wait, hold on. What's this? All right, that's personal wardrobe here. But I gotta admit, this game does seem like a lot of fun. I'm not joking when I say that. Um, <laughs> the only problem is they make those girls' boobs way too big. It tempts me to play as them. It really does. Um, any other uh, things I have left to say? Let's see. Uh, combat. Very good. Um, I don't really like that. Uh, uh I mean, I honestly don't know. It's like, the combat is real-time, and that's what I love. I love real-time get fighting. I mean, I'm not, it's not like I say, it's like, you know, war, uh, war, I play World of Warcraft. You know, I'm not saying that, you know, the combat's bad, because this whole right-click, and then you have all these different kind of strategies. I'm not saying it's bad. Right, I'm not. I, I love this whole real-time strategy thing. I love it. Or, not strategy, combat. I just adore it. I love it so much. I mean, it's not just a uh, right-click you know, oh, I'm pressing number one for a buff. I need to use one of my special abilities. You block, you grab. I mean, you don't really see that many games like um, MMORPGs. I mean, I probably can name a few, but I mean, it's not like that. There's that many. I mean, they're like DC Universe is like the only other game right now that I know of where it's like you can you attack yourself and it's an MMORPG. So, I guess there is a story to it. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't really, wasn't paying attention that much. I guess there is a story. Um, well, say, as for an RPG, eh, I mean, it's an MMO game. It's not like an RPG, though, as far as I can tell. You can equip your characters some stuff, but there's really no personal. I mean, you probably level like you can probably customize the way he levels up, but 
Other than that, only thing you can change about your character is what clothes they wear. I I mean, I guess that's the way they animate the game. Maybe this is just for the beta. Maybe we can customize the characters. I I again, like I said, I have really no idea other than my first impression of the game, which was right now. What I've been playing is the first time I ever heard of this game, or actually read about the game or stuff. That's all I know. So, what do I think? You should definitely uh, go on stream or uh, download it. Download it now. Uh, give it a try. You know, if you're into you know, MMORPG games, if you're into real-time uh, fighting games, like you know, and you didn't really like the way you know certain MMORPGs play because they're always just right-click. Yeah, give this game a try. I mean, there's no reason. I mean, I think it's really, really good. It's exciting during the fight. I got really pumped up for it. All I can say, though, um, download the game for yourself, play it, and, I don't know, leave a comment in the description. Remember, Grey Matters 8, uh, his link is in the description below. Uh, he'll have more insight on the game, so if you want to know more about this game, you might ask me, because I will definitely play the game more, or you, you can ask him, since he already is pretty much an expert of the game. Or, not an expert, but close. Peace out.